Welcome to our presentation for the submission of the fake news classification task of Media Evil 2020. We've responded to both subtasks, and for the natural language processor based subtask, we propose a bag of words inspired model. We wish to assign a score to every word used in the development data, and we're doing this by comparing the prevalence in one class compared to the second class. First, every word is assigned a score. By then taking a tweet in the unknown class, and assigning each word in the tweet its own score and taking the geometric of these words, we find the overall score of one tweet where a high tweet or a high score indicates that the tweet belongs in the first class. By doing this twice, first comparing 5G conspiracy to others and then taking all the others and comparing non or other conspiracy to non conspiracy, we get a ranked. A Ranked list of all tweets where a high score indicates that the tweet belongs in the 5G conspiracy class. By then inserting a threshold, we can try and classify every tweet into these three classes. We then propose our results where the binary classification reaches 0.85 or 0.385 and the multi class classification reaches 0.372. Okay, so for a structural based uh, detection task, we are using uh, graph neural networks as a, as a classifier. And we do uh, three uh, classification tasks, both uh, multi-class and binary, and uh, with and without additional node features. So we, we train, um, we first do a hyper-parameter optimization with um, uh, cross-validation, and then retrain um, retrain a model with the optimal uh, parameters, doing a 80-20 split of the development set, and then do the classification on the uh, testing set. And um, the, um, the multi-class uh, classification with additional node features uh, performs uh, pretty decent and um, the the uh, the score goes down uh, once we only operate on the structure of the of the graphs, and um, the binary classification has even a lower uh, score. Um, and it's a simple illustration of how the GNN um, how the GNN works. In the uh, image below, we're doing node embeddings, and then with some kind of readout, we then do the classification of the graphs.